Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> I'm so excited for today's video because we are going to be doing first impressions of Fenty Skin. I love Riri so much, so you guys know I had to pick up this Fenty Skin line. I literally picked up every single product that she released. If you want to see my first impressions on the new Fenty Skin launch, then definitely keep on watching. Oh! It's not that heavy. I'm just being dramatic. I got everything right here. Everything looks so pretty. This just came in the mail today. And y'all, good skincare is expensive. Okay, I'm just saying that right now. This stuff was expensive. So yeah, let's go ahead and get into these products. So the first thing we got is the Total Cleanser and Honey. You get 4.9 fluid ounces in here, and it is a hyper clean, soft skin without stripping or drying, daily cleanser and makeup remover in one. Lee Riri's mind. She did a cleanser and a makeup remover in one. What more can you ask for when it comes to good cleanser? So I'm excited to try this. Oh, and the packaging. I love the aesthetic of this packaging. The soft purple, like lavendery color is just up my vibe. I love purple. And this looks absolutely stunning. The next thing we got up in here is this fat water. This is a pore refining toner serum. You get five fluid ounces in here. Oh, I didn't even see how much the cleanser retails for. Oh my gosh. So the cleanser retails for $21.31. That's not a bad price for a good cleanser, honestly. It's really, really not. So the next product we have in here is this Total Fat Water or Refining Toner Serum. At first I was like, Riri, why you named it Fat Water? But apparently she named it Fat Water because of its consistency. It's very thick. And this is a toner that you don't have to use a cotton round for. You just use your hands this is supposed to instantly refine the look of pores reduce the look of dark spots even skin tone fights shine without stripping skin this is what i need this is exactly what i need this packaging is really getting me like it really really is lastly we have the hydra visor invisible moisture broad spectrum spf 30 sunscreen Riri gave us a moisturizer with a sunscreen in it. I love that. Why am I forgetting to tell you guys the prices? I don't know. So the so the toner retails for $23.86. Now I'm looking at these prices and the scents looks a little weird. I think it's because I bought this as a set. So I can it's kind of discounted. I think total the I think the total price is $80 for all three if you were to buy it separate, but as a set, it's $75, so that's why the prices are a little different than what I remember, I bought it as a set. This Hydrovisor Moisturizer and Sunscreen retails for $29.83. I want to say it retails for $30, I don't know, but these are the prices that I have because I got it together in a bundle. This says it is a light as air hydration and visible sun protection. Defends and brightens skin while reducing the look of pores and it's oil free. Made with care for coral reefs. Does not contain oxide benzone or oxid, oxid I cannot say that. I'm not even about to try. You get 1.7 fluid ounces and this is a earth conscious packaging. This comes with refills. I love that. I don't know how much the refills are, but I love that this packaging is refillable. So, how do you do this? Remove refill for product information. Oh, oh, that's cool. Okay, so, oh, wait, did it work? Did it work? How am I supposed to know if it's in? How do I know if it's in? Oh, okay, I felt it. Okay, so wow. This is cool. This looks fancy. Oh my god, I feel, this feels so fancy. So now for the fun part, I'm going to move you guys into my bathroom and we're going to test out these products. So let's go. I have you guys in my bathroom. I don't know how this sounds, but you're in my bathroom. So we're going to go ahead and start off with the cleanser. So it says that skin work into lather. I have on makeup. I thought this would be a really, really great time to try out these products. Well, I have makeup on, so I'm going to wet my face face is nice and wet oh okay so so cool so what you do is you I'm guessing you just 
twist. It doesn't come off, so this is a nice way to protect the environment. I think all the packaging is re like recyclable, so I'm just going to take... Oh, it's thick, honey. She thick. Mmm, okay. Okay, so I'm just going to rub this. Okay, if this gets out my way, I'm going to rub this in. It has a light fragrance scent to it, so nothing too overpowering for me. I know for some people it is, it can be a lot, but it just says work into a lather. I'm just gonna wet my face a little bit more. All right, so now I'm going to just rinse this off. It feels really, really good, and it seems like it's getting my makeup off because it's like all on my hands. So I'm gonna go ahead and rinse my face. Alright, so my face is washed and it actually feels really, really hydrated, believe it or not. My face feels kind of like tacky, but in a good way. Like, I feel like I don't need to go and put on lotion after using this cleanser. So, it did also remove my makeup. I mean, I have a little bit of mascara under my eyes right here, but everything else came off. That is a waterproof mascara, but it really, really removed quite a bit of my makeup. So I'm very, very impressed. Now we're going to go in with the toner, which is what I'm excited about. It says I don't have to use a cotton round because I normally use a cotton round for my toner because it's so liquidy. But, oh, honey. Okay, so there's a little sticker on the top. Love her idea behind this packaging. Okay, so you just twist and it opens. So, oh, oh, she's big. Oh, wow, this, this also has a light fragrance scent to it. But it feels really, really good. It's actually not like, like too thick. Like it is thick for a toner, but it actually really feels really nice. Feels good. Okay, now my face is getting a little like, kind of tacky it had to like settle into my skin but my face feels really really hydrated so now we're gonna go ahead and go in with the moisturizer so I'm just gonna take oh it's pink too it's like pink I don't know if you guys can see my ring light is kind of washing it out but oh this smells good okay this has more fragrance in it than the other two products but it smells really good so but if you're sensitive to fragrance i know a lot of people are sensitive to fragrance which i understand sometimes it can be overpowering but this smells really good i'm not really sensitive to fragrance but i know some people are this feels so good and i'm guessing there's a lot of fragrance in this Moisturize with the SPF because there's SPF in it and SPF can smell like sunscreen. You know what I mean? You guys know what I'm talking about, but I like this. I guess that fragrance is to mask the smell of the SPF. These products were really nice for my first impressions of trying it. Of course, I'm going to continue to try out these products and I'm going to do a check-in with you guys as the days go on and I continue to use this and see a difference. But so far, my favorite products have to be the toner, and then I love the scent of the moisturizer. But the toner and the cleanser are my two favorite products thus far. I'm going to continue to use this. I'm just happy to have a moisturizer that has an SPF 30 because I was using a moisturizer that only has an SPF 15. And that ain't doing much for me, but SPF 30, I upgraded, so I'm happy about that. And like I said, the only one that has the most like powerful fragrance is the moisturizer with the SPF in it. But the other two, I feel like are really, really bearable, very, very, very faint fragrance in these two. But yeah, I love the packaging, very innovative, and I can't wait to see what Rihanna comes out with next because I can't wait for like the face masks and like the like lip mask all that good stuff and i love it i'm happy like i'm just so far so good with these products so yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys in my next video
Peace.